of you guys if you're a student right now whether it's middle school high school college doctorate master's PhD whatever it is and whatever major that you might be in in undergrad whether it's pre-physical therapy exercise science history uh, nursing liberal arts uh, what I don't, I don't know there's so many of them chances are you're probably studying right now and you're trying to work towards something of being a certain type of profession now this video is gonna be talking about how to take your student learning experience to the next level. Now, 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 stick with me for a quick second before I get into that intro. You right now as a student, your investment being a student and learning everything that you're learning in school is gonna be the biggest, biggest, most important and biggest investment to become the best and highest quality professional later on. What's up you guys, my name is Justin Lee, doctor of physical therapy student and fitness coach. Here you'll find videos on fitness, physical therapy and lifestyle that helps inspire self change. This channel is all about lifting others and lifting weights. So let's lift for a change people. This video is all about lifting you up today. All right, this video is gonna be just a little bit shorter and I just wanna share two points on how to take your learning to the next level. Okay, first point, you gotta have a growth mindset. Now, what does this mean? Yeah, you have your psychology class, right? Your growth mindset versus fixed mindset. The fixed mindset means like you're the stubborn man, you're the stubborn person, and you just, you just fix in your own way of thinking and you're not willing to learn or grow in different aspects. And a growth mindset is more like, hey, you have something to teach me, I'm willing to look into that perspective and I wanna grow and I wanna grow in this way, in this way, in this way, in this way. You gotta practice that mindset, that growth mindset. Now, think about it like this. Remember when you were a kid and you had Play-Doh? You gotta be like that. You gotta be moldable. You gotta be pliable. You gotta be able to stretch and grow, right? And you also gotta learn when to be compact, right? And you gotta learn to be into different types of shapes. So you gotta have a moldable heart. That means whatever professor or teacher or mentor, or if you're a physical therapy student, if you're a CI, your clinical instructor is trying to teach you something, they are trying to teach you something that you do not know. And yeah, maybe sometimes like there'll be a teacher and they're trying to teach you something. You're like, oh, that's so dumb. I don't wanna learn any of that. There, there may be cases like that, but there is probably a reason and a purpose for why they're trying to teach you that. And so I really challenge you to think about why are they trying to teach me that and how can I learn from them? Because if you think about it, yeah, they have more experience than you, right? You are the student, you paid a lot of money to become that student, and you paid a lot of money to learn from this professor. So instead of being there like, oh, this professor sucks, I don't wanna learn from them, this teacher sucks, their attitude sucks, whatever, that might be the case, but bottom line is they have more experience than you. So who are you to think as a student like I am better than them? Absolutely the wrong way to think. If you're thinking like that, Definitely give this a thumbs down. Like, I don't care because like, you have to have that growth mindset. You gotta have that teachable heart. If you're teachable, that means your goals are reachable. Now my second point, dig deeper. <laughs> you guys ever uh, heard Shanti and in Insanity? Dig deeper. Professor, I'm like, why do I do the things that I do? Cause I wanna look good. That is bananas, yo. That's what I mean, dig deeper. Dig deeper in the knowledge, in the books. Like, don't just go to class, learn that information, and go home and do your stuff. Like, there, there is a time for that to like just relax, but if you're trying to invest, remember how this is the most important time, right? If you're trying to invest your time right now, learn and take from the class, focus your all your attention in that class, get rid of all the distractions, your phones, put it on, put it on do not disturb mode, focus everything you can in that class, take your notes, then that night, Go home, review it, right? Review everything that you've learned. And then the next time you have your class again, 
go to your professor and ask them, hey, I have a couple follow-up questions. As I was studying this, I wanted to ask you a little bit more so that I can have a better understanding. Now, digging deeper is so important to taking your learning to the next level because there, that is probably the biggest pitfall that most students fall under. They'll come to class, they'll learn the information, they'll just do enough to get by, and then they just move on. Now, I'm gonna tell you right now, everything that I've done in my class, every single class that I've taken, no matter how boring or how, I mu how much I thought it was unuseful, or not <laughs> unuseful, not useful, I did everything that I can, could, now, digging deeper is super important as a student. And I think that's a lot of, that's where a lot of students miss because they just go to class, learn the information and then bounce, right? But then, no, 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 don't do that. Take it to the next level, apply the knowledge. If you're in that kinesiology class, learn how the body moves and then apply it in your workout. If you're in that history class, learn that history and go to that location and learn more about that history. To ask those deeper, most more critical thinking questions and when you start practicing that a lot more, you're gonna absorb that knowledge, you're gonna retain that knowledge, and you're gonna take your learning to the next level. So if you're a student right now, and you are like, uh, I don't wanna be in class, or this information sucks, or you're just like not in, in that motivational uh, status or stage of your life, I really encourage you to take these two uh, tips that I, I've just shared with you, and apply them right now. There you go, point number two, apply what you're learning right now. Have the teachable heart to take in what I'm trying to teach you and then dig deeper and then apply it into whatever you're doing right now. So if you think about it, the only way you're gonna fail is if you don't put in the effort. If you work hard, if you put in the effort, if you're going to those office hours, if you're going to your professor and asking those follow-up questions, they're going to help you, you're going to help you, and you're going to be successful. I hope this information was helpful for all of you guys. If you're a student right now and you're in a rut, give this a thumbs up. If you found this information helpful, please put it in the comments. If you have any follow-up questions, put it in the comments. All right, thank you, you guys. This channel is all about lifting others and lifting weights. So let's lift for change, people. Have a great one, you guys.